Lesson 26, Day 26 About Children It is forbidden to speak Lashon Ara about children. While most people understand that kids are kids, and the Torah does not hold children responsible for their actions, if one speaks about a child in a manner that either the speaker or listener sees as derogatory, then the laws of Shemiros Hashalon have been violated. It is also forbidden to say or write something about a child that potentially could prove harmful to him. A teacher who is prepared to enter a negative comment on a student's record should pause to contemplate the effect that entry might have on the student's future educational and employment opportunities. Likewise, teachers should exercise caution and fairness when conveying their feelings concerning a student to his teacher for the coming year. Pure and untainted. The Talmud states, Resh Lakish said in the name of Rabbi Yehuda Nisaya, the world is sustained only in the merit of the breath of Torah of school children. Said Rav Papa to Abaye, and what is with yours and mine, i.e. our Torah study? Abaye replied, there is no comparison between breath that is tainted by sin and breath that is free of sin. If the sages were to their minds guilty of forbidden speech, it could only have been an inadvertent and rare occurrence. Yet they declared their words of divine service to be tainted because of this. How much more so is this true of one who habitually speaks the forbidden? Especially Lashonara, which causes ill will and strife among Jews.